early October, the busy streets of San Francisco are going to be transformed into a sea of uniforms. Sailors, Marines and Coast Guardsmen will be in port for Fleet Week 2011. 10,000 service members will pass under the Golden Gate Bridge on ships, just as they have for the past 30 years for the event. It's a great city, so the opportunity to be up there wearing the uniform and highlighting the Marine Corps is absolutely perfect. Scheduled highlights are the Navy's Blue Angels, Marine demonstrations similar to this one from Marine Week St. Louis, and a band competition, a big crowd draw from last year. People, once they heard the band playing, started opening up their doors and came out to listen to the band. People, tourists who were walking on the street, did the exact same thing. So with an event that had very little publicity, we had hundreds of people. This year's Fleet Week is also a time for city emergency planners and military leadership to exercise how they will work together and respond to an earthquake, an event that's not an if, but a when. We see this as an opportunity for us to do some training on, on things that do come across our way from time to time, but in particular, a mission that would be very challenging and one I suspect we could be tasked with in the event that were to occur. For the citizens of San Francisco, Fleet Week has traditionally been a time to thank those in uniform for their service, especially since 9-11. They make you proud, you know, that they're very professional, very courteous, very well trained and just well behaved, I must say. And we just had a, a ball with them, you know, I, I'm in the restaurant business, I own a restaurant in San Francisco, and we just had a, a room full of very happy people. and. Uh, they had a very, very hard time buying a drink. I don't think any of them put their hand in their pocket, which is the way it should be. Fleet Week runs from October 6th through the 11th. In San Francisco, I'm Staff Sergeant Brian Buckland.